don't know what's going on. Conversation's going to be awkward to start, and I don't know how Dixie's going to react. Um, it's a rough kind of thing going on. How do you feel about Charlie doing music? I'm not doing it for like any reason other than like I just had fun and I made a cool song and like I enjoy listening to it and I would want to do like something cool with it instead of just keep it to myself, you know? She's been worried about like being respectful of everything you're doing and your album coming out and she's like that's been the forefront of her conversations and all this. We didn't we don't really want anything to come out about Charlie's music till after Dixie's single comes out, her album comes out and she starts her tour. Oh, you guys are so sweet. Charlie lied to me. What'd she lie to you about? When um, she was going to start working with Greg, and she goes, can you get Greg's number for me? I want to talk about him with security. I was scared. Were you scared? I couldn't even actually, like, listen about what they were trying to tell me because I was like, you guys have been lying to me for months. It was secret and private on the calendar, but I did know that she was doing a lot of vocal lessons. I was like, oh, that's weird for a horror movie. She's going to be doing vocal lessons. Were they going to have code names on your calendar, right? Yeah. We, we actually said I was going to acting class. But God, she's so pretty and funny and witty. I don't think that I'd stand a chance. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> there were some situations where I was just like, it's so weird. And then it all started connecting. When Charlie releases music, it's going to cause a lot of drama for me. I don't think you're going to care, Dixie, honestly. I was caught off guard and then expected to be like, oh my God, this is so perfect. You know what? Why don't you put this song on my album? We could do it together. Like, that's how they wanted me to react. And I'm like, guys, no. <laughs> oh, don't put your freaking nail in my ear. I feel bad because she didn't have the best reaction. Although I thought in the beginning, keeping it away from her would have been better. It did not work out that way. It more came from just, I was uncomfortable and I didn't know how to say it. What the hell just happened? Like, I thought you were the only person I could really trust in the world. That's not fair. That's not fair to me. So how are we supposed to live with each other anymore? 